It's Thursday the 26th of March and this is Bartender's Breakfast. Hi guys, we're back again. How, how is everyone doing? I hope everyone is doing well. Hello. What are you doing? I'm on the camera. Can I on camera? You are on the camera. Can you see you? Yeah. yeah. Say hello. Hello. Say your help. It's a PSA from Ted. Yee. Hello you. Hello. What's that? That is Bartender's Breakfast. Yeah. As we go through this period where everything's pretty much closed, uh, we are going to find that there's not a great deal of news to talk about. However, uh, let's talk about... Um, um, uh, I really don't know what to say today. One thing I have been seeing a lot of on Instagram and on Facebook and stuff is quarantine flair. So there's a lot of guys that are out there who are making use of the time to improve their flair bartending, increasing kind of their skill level and also doing little challenges between one another so they'll like start one move and then the next person has to do that move and then a follow on move and then blah 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 so there's some cool stuff going on at the moment uh, Dean Parkin, uh, thank you mate um, Dean is one of my uh, one of my bros that uh, used to work with me in Dubai um, <laughs> gave me a little shout out saying have you got a flare bottle, mine's broken so he came over, uh, basically I just uh, left it outside the front. Uh, he brought us some shopping, so thank you so much, Dean. Um, but he's gonna be doing some flare video stuff. He's, you know, using his exercise uh, allowance to go to the park and throw some bottles around, which is a cool way of doing it. And I do encourage bartenders out there, if you have any outdoor space that you can use, if you have a garden or a little yard or whatever, get outdoors, don't be cooped up inside your house, um, as far as I'm aware, that is allowed at the moment is you're allowed outdoors, but just within your own property kind of thing. So you're still self-isolating. Um, but do try to be outdoors. Do try and see the sunlight. Try not to be cooped up in a dark little office in, uh, in your bedroom. Uh, make sure you keep moving, keep exercising as much as possible. Exercise is really going to be important for, you, uh, for everyone. Um, it's going to be vital that people keep moving and keep themselves in as good physical shape as humanly possible because the more fit and well that you are, the better you are placed to deal with any virus that you might get anyway. Definitely try and keep yourselves active. I've signed up for the uh, Bar Smarts course that I mentioned on yesterday's show, so uh, I'll put the link again in here. You need to use um, you need to use the code TRYBARSMARTS. I'll put that on the uh, website along with the code. I believe that offer finishes for the free Bar Smarts thing in uh, in April so you've got a little bit of time at the moment so please if you are interested in doing that it's well worth doing it you get 60 days to actually do the course uh, which is going to be absolutely massive amount of time uh, given the amount of uh, people that are not doing anything else at the moment that are not in the bars that the bars are closed it's a perfect opportunity to raise your game if you already are comfortable with your spirits knowledge there is an option for spirits and wine i think as a combined course or there's an advanced spirits course uh, they're both normally 29 bucks and they're completely free at the minute so really good time to get in and it gives you a good grounding if you want to go and do the bar smarts advanced which is the in-person stuff and i think that's with del de groff so it's going to be a really really useful thing for people to know um so super quick thing today uh my little challenge to everyone, if you've not done the quarantini uh, challenge yet, I would love to see some quarantini challenges going up there and make sure you tag me on Instagram at bartenderhqpix or on Twitter at bartenderhq so that I can see what you're doing. Um, make sure you use the hashtag quarantini challenge as well. I know there's a few people out there that are now doing exactly the same thing. Don't care, it's just interesting to see what bartenders are getting up to at home. Uh, make the most of weird ingredients that you've got knocking around. If you've had a competition that you've entered at some point, you won a bottle of some weird vermouth, use that. Like, it's a cool opportunity to use some stuff that you would not normally even find yourself opening the bottle of. In terms of new stuff, as I say, there's not a massive amount going on. I know that Perno Ricard has now bought out uh, Monkey 47 uh, entirely. I don't know when that happened. Let's have a quick check. So that's actually breaking news today. Uh, Perno Ricard has bought the full stakes in Monkey 47. Uh, Ryan Reynolds is being his usual, usual awesome self and donating a bunch of the profits from Aviation Gin to support bartenders in the US and Canada. 
which is pretty cool, and offer licenses in the UK can stay open. So, your customers, if you own a bar or you work in a bar, your customers can still get their hands on alcohol. There's also plenty of delivery services like Click and Drink, which is the one that my company runs. Um, but also off licenses are open, so your customers will have drinks. Um, it's up to you to help them drink better. They're missing out on being able to drink great cocktails in your bars at the minute, so educate them, give them the tools so that they can make great drinks themselves at home, and when they want to come back, they'll remember that you helped them drink better at home. My voice is not great. Uh, my hair is getting far too long. I'm going to look like a shipwreck. Uh, shipwrecked desert island inhabitant very very soon so I'm going to wrap it up there for today it's a super short one I'm sorry but yesterday was a bit longer if you've got any questions about doing the social media stuff please hit me up in the comments I would love to help you guys out and also if you want to start your side hustle uh, go and search first in line on Facebook that is the Gary Vanichuk uh, forum that I help moderate uh, he's doing questions and answers sessions pretty much every day I think from at home uh, because everyone is self isolating and uh, you will get a lot out of it especially if you have ever wanted to move into marketing you can do it for your bar you can do it for other bars you can work out you, this could be a new career path for people if it's something that you're interested in doing so hit me up um, I would love to help you with anything that I can. Peace out guys, it is David here for Bartender HQ and The Breakfast Show. See you tomorrow.